Hello, hello. It is so good to see everybody. Got Kate here with me. She's going to help me give away some stuff. What do you think? We're going to have some fun. They are going to have some fun. Absolutely. How are you guys doing? See, we, we were, you can see we were staring at the screen. We're looking at a delay. There we go. There we go. I know. So, I am so excited, everybody. We have um, reached 4,000 subscribers. Can you believe it? I mean, it's crazy. I remember when I was so excited to just get to 1,000 subscribers, and then 2,000 subscribers. Then we were at three, and, and then all of a sudden we're at four. It like happened so fast. I don't know. Hey guys, wow, all my old friends are here. I'm so excited to see you guys. All right, well, and there's Donna in North Carolina. I know Donna. <laughs> hey Beth. Oh, it's your first live, yay. You guys, I am feeling so, so, so much better. I can't even tell you. Um, all of the pain is gone. So the surgery that I had, so we'll give you a quick little update before we get to the giveaways. So um, I had suffered from, for those of you who it's your first live, I had suffered from back and neck and headaches, like so bad I had to have nerve blocks. It was that bad, it was debilitating. And it went on, it was almost two years, and it just kept getting worse and worse and worse and worse. And so I finally had um, breast reduction surgery, <laughs> which it seems crazy that that would cause so much pain. Like, who would think that the weight of your chest would put your hip out of place? Like, <laughs> yeah. So, so yeah, so we had the surgery, and then within three days of the surgery, because I finally was walking after three days. I spent a lot of time in bed the first couple of days. Yeah, Kate was there to take care of me. Kate, everybody needs a Kate. <laughs> but um, the third day I was walking and I was like, huh, my hip doesn't hurt. It kind of had that like soreness, you know, like that healing soreness that you get. And um, sure enough, my hip went back into place all on its own. My back quit hurting. I had headaches for maybe like a, a couple light headaches that week. Haven't had a headache since. Uh-oh, I think we might be frozen. Okay, hopefully we're not frozen. I saw a little spinning there. We're, we're hooked into the internet, so hopefully we'll be good. Hey, we got New York. Wow, we got Panama, Lincolnshire in the UK. Oh my gosh, you guys are coming from everywhere. Thanks, Nan. Hey, Flames. Flames Plays is on. Nice. You know who that is? <laughs> I, yeah, I know. He's a very <laughs> special person in my life. Look, Nan says they love you. <laughs> so, yeah, so I've just been getting better and better. Still not 100% because I've got incisions, um, issues, and stuff like that. But it's Kate is having to, like, run across the room and tackle me at times to keep me from doing <laughs> I do not. <laughs> she just wants to. <laughs> She's nagging me. So, yeah, so I'm super thrilled, and if any of you have um, that kind of issue and you want to talk to me about my experience, I'm happy to do that. I mean, we could do a live on it if enough people say they want me to talk about it. It's kind of a weird thing to talk publicly about, but um, <laughs> High Flames Plays, that's my son Chase, you guys. Um, he's starting a YouTube channel. He hasn't uploaded anything yet, but if you're interested in gaming, um, you can go subscribe to Flames Plays there who's in the chat and <laughs> get him some subscribers before he even starts. Um, so anyway, um, yeah, if it's something you guys are interested in, I'm willing to, to talk about the experience, um, but I don't want to like, you know, put it out there unless anybody really feels like it, it will help them. So you guys just let me know. But, um, all right, so that's the surgery update. Um, almost, almost there. A couple more weeks, and I feel like I'll be back to my old self, so I'm pretty excited about that. Just in time for the fall. Hey, Maureen. Hey, Amanda. Thank you so much. So, what do you guys say we get to some giveaways? Oh, Beth is healing from surgery. Her Kate is named Cliff. Good. <laughs> Everybody needs a Kate. All right, let me get this laptop out of the way and we're gonna flip the camera over and we're gonna get to some giveaways. Yay! So we have to come up with trivia questions. Yes, we do. I know one of them that I wanna ask. All right, let's see how this looks. Oh, look, you can see my microphone. Whoops, you can see some of the, the prizes. Okay, here, I'm gonna hold on to your ears. I'm gonna move this microphone for a second. Oops, thank you. Okay, 
We're, we'll do it that way. Okay. Thank you, Jerry. The dog is climbing up on our laps. <laughs> he wants to be part of the part of the giveaway. Okay. So I just have a few. We're going to do this the way we usually do. But for those of you who are new, I'll put my hand out here so you can see me. For those of you that are new, um, here's how we do it. We go ahead and we give away some items here on the live. And then for the people who um, are either hearing impaired, it's hard to participate in a live when you're hearing impaired because they don't have any closed captions. The closed captions don't come up until after things process. So... Um, we are going to also give away prizes in the replay. So if you're hearing impaired or you just couldn't make it to the live, you also get a chance to win, um, which we're very excited about. And our grand prize this time is going to happen in the replay comments. However, we do have some really good prizes here on the live. Uh, Flames Plays, no, you cannot enter. Family and friends are prohibited. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, so let's see. I think uh, the first thing that we're going to give away, let's see, we need to think of a question, and then I'll, let me show them what it is. So we recently restocked the store with um, some bead caps that go with the purple bead roller. So that is going to be the first prize. You are going to get some solid silver, these are, I think, 316, right? Mm -hmm. 316 bead caps. And they're the ones with the long cores, too, so they're a little bit, stand a little bit better. You're going to get um, green, silver, white, and red. So just in time for your Christmas crafts. All right, so if you would like some of these, these are the ones that fit um, really nicely into the Euro beads and the, with the purple bead roller. All right, so this will be for our first one. So let me see. Um, our trivia question is, Kate and I are just looking at each other right now. Um, okay, here we go. So now, oh, let me also say the rules. Okay, so I have a question. You're gonna put the answer in the chat. And um, unfortunately, everybody is probably going to see their answer first because it doesn't have to go over their internet connection. But the winner is going to be the person that I see on my chat with the answer first. Okay, so just know that you're not going to be in the same order as you are on my screen because it takes a while for things to go over the internet. Okay, all right, so here we go. So the first question is, um, I am running a contest right now. What is the theme of the contest? So you can make something out of paper beads and you can enter it in and you can win a full set of paper bead rollers and you just have to send me a picture. What is the theme of that contest? I sent it in an email and I put it in Paper Bead Fanatics group. Thank you, Flames. Deanna got it first. Deanna Llewellyn got it first. It is a teapot contest. That was that was good. That was fast, Deanna. Can you write down uh, yes. the names? Here's a pen. I've got. Look pens. at you. What I do with my pencil? <laughs> it's not in your hat. Kate has a, a hat that uh, holds her pencil. It's kind of cool. We'll have to show it to you. So a lot of you got it. Good job. You're paying attention. Yes. So um, Deanna, you are gonna win the purple bead roller cores, a whole set of Christmas colors for your Christmas crafts. Yay, Deanna. Okay, we'll put this one to the side. That's prize number one. We got more coming though. Um, the next prize is actually going to be two sets of the teapot charm so that you can enter the contest. And this includes shipping and everything else. Oh, don't worry, Donna. We're not judging on spelling. You're fine. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> we are going to... Um, Giveaway, we're going to send you, and this includes shipping, by the way. These prizes, you don't have to pay anything. They just, we're sending them right out to you. Um, two of these teapot sets. So that way you can make one and, and enter it and have two to choose from. All right, so let's see. 
Um, what question should we ask for this? How about, hey, Susie, how are you? Susie is a past winner. She recently won something, I believe. Let's see, what could we ask? Oh, um, I know, I know. Okay, for this one, you would have had to have watched the video I put out recently. Um, so if you've watched the video that I, that I just put out, I think it was yesterday, right? It's about mm -hmm. the, can you make money with a paper bead business? I gave four tips, name one. And it just real quick, the real quick version of the tips. So we have, yeah, we do have a little delay. Thanks, Flames. And uh, so Kate and I will await your answer. It can be any one of the four tips that I gave on the, um, the video. So if you need to go look real quick, well, I think you can't, you have to play it. I don't think I have them typed out. Yeah, Jerry got it. I'll accept that. Get on the internet. Uh, sell online. So Jerry is our winner of two sets of teapots. Tell you what, let's give away um, another set of teapots to the second person who got this. That is Nan Sherman. Let's give her teapots too. Okay. Oh, you guys are good. A lot of you watched that video, nice job. So let's ask another question um, from that video since so many of you watched it. This time we're gonna give away a bead roller of your choice. So you can choose a regular size bead roller, you can choose a thick handled bead roller like this one, you can choose a, a painted bead roller if you want, any bead roller of your choice, okay? Oh, and by the way, you can only win once. So if you already won, you can still guess, but just one prize per person. Okay, so the question here, and I'll have to do that video too. Um, we talked about pricing in that video, and a lot of people commented to me, or several people commented to me, that they were really surprised, like pricing is difficult, and they were surprised at um, the multiplier I suggested what is the ideal multiplier if you're selling your jewelry? What was that first multiplier that I showed? I gave you a few, but the first one that I showed in the formula. Let's see who comes up with this one. This one's tougher. We'll see how, how much they listened. So the, and the multiplier was um, how much you multiply your cost for. Donna McCormick won the first one. So we got mm -hmm. some, okay. Okay. All right. So, um, Jerry, you actually got it first on my screen, but you already won something. Nan, Nan already won. Donna McCormick, you are the next person who got four. Four is the answer. Look, you guys are good. Everybody named a multiplier that I had in the video, but four, multiplier number four is the first, um, the first multiplier. So, so Deanna, what we'll do is, um, Donna. Or Donna, sorry. Yeah, Deanna Donna. Got the Deanna first was one. the first prize. So Donna, actually all the prize winners, um, what you'll need to do, if you've already ordered from me in the past, I have your shipping address, so I already have it. But if you've never ordered from me, you'll need to email me at contact at paperbeadrollers.com and send me your shipping address. Um, and um, Donna, you'll need to tell me what bead roller you want. So tell me what color you want, and then if you want the regular handle or the large handle or the painted, the ones that are completely painted. And you can have any of those. All right. That is awesome. That went fast. Yeah. <laughs> Usually we mess around a little bit before we give away prizes. So, but I do have a big announcement about the prize that I'm giving away for the replay. You guys are going to want to watch this. And this is, I put it in the replay because this is a really big deal. Okay. And I wanted everybody to have a chance to win this next prize. So we're, we're actually done. Congratulations to everybody. And we have here, let's, will you read off the winners for me? Just so we know we have them right. All right, the uh, 316 cores, we got Deanna. And then the teapot sets go to Nan and Jerry. And then Donna won the bead roller for choice. All right, congratulations, you guys. Good job. All right, so here is the prize, the grand prize that we're going to give away in the for the replay comments. And the way that the replay comments work is um, after this live video gets done, Flip the camera. No, because I want to show them this. Oh, okay. Um, after the live video gets done, um, it will take a minute and then it will process and it will go out there for people to watch in the replay and it'll have closed captions 
and then it will have, you'll be able to make comments, okay? Flames, no, darling, <laughs> you cannot win the grand prize either. <laughs> no family. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, hey, <laughs> I'm sorry, he just cracks me up. He's just teasing me. He asked me this before the live, too. <laughs> he really wants a prize. Um, where was I even at? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I was saying what you'll do is you'll comment on the replay. And then I use an automated comment picker who will randomly choose winners from everybody who comments. Now listen, here is the secret to winning on the replay. You got to comment more than once, okay? And I don't mind if you spam the comments. You can say funny things. It doesn't matter what you say in your comment. Um, but you can comment as much as you want. Okay, so here is the absolute grand prize. Ta-da! Yay! You don't actually get to see what's in this for this Christmas present here. Um, but what is in this Christmas present is all of the new release findings that we are releasing for Christmas. It's kind of, I don't know, it's pretty heavy. I would say, how many things in there? What do we put in there? Six? Maybe I better count. I can't Six, see. Seven. Six or seven sets of findings are in this bag. But here's even the better part. Not only are you going to win this Christmas present with all of the brand new Christmas findings in it, but you are going to get to spill the beans on what these are. So if you win this, when you get this in the mail, you get to be the first one to take a picture of all the new products and put them up in the Paper Bee Fanatics Facebook group. So you get to spill the beans, be the bean spiller mm -hmm. for all the new stuff. So how about that? I think that's pretty exciting, don't you think? I think it's awesome. Yeah, awesome. I keep forgetting y'all can't see me nod. <laughs> I know, and we have a little delay. So, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and flip the camera back to us. And we have a little delay, so we haven't actually seen uh, your reaction to this yet, because it looks like the delay has gotten pretty long, to be honest. Oops, wait, the camera's not. Don't look. <laughs> You're gonna get dizzy. You're gonna get dizzy. Okay, I think you can see us now. Oh, wait, there we go. <laughs> we're, we're all over the place with this camera. I need a, I need a camera I can just switch now. There, there we go. There we go. So, um, let me move this over so I don't look like I'm turning my head away from you guys. Okay. Oh, you guys like that prize. Okay, good, good, good. So glad. So, okay. So that is the replay prize. Um, so what will happen is you comment on, comment on the live and on Sunday, I'll, it, late at night, like at midnight, I'll do the random, um, generator that will tell me who won um, that prize and then I'm going to coordinate with the winner because I need to know as soon as you spill the beans All of those findings will be available for sale on the website So I just need to know when you're going to do it and we'll coordinate and then everything will be available And then I'll do a live too just mm -hmm. so I can walk you guys through what all of them are. All right So hey Natalie Natalie just joined us So I was just we already gave away the prizes that um, happen on the live but the replay comments there's going to be a really big prize where somebody gets to uh, spill the beans on a bunch of new findings that we're giving away. So you get to win them, and then you get to be the one that tells everybody about it in Paper Bead Fanatics. So that'll be the deal. So we won't know till Sunday who gets that prize. But also, that's not going to be the only prize for the replay. Um, we're also going to give away some more teapots because I want, to, I want you guys to enter the teapot contest. We haven't had any entries yet. Yeah. So if you've entered, um, I didn't get it, so there may be something wrong. <laughs> but I figured it would take a couple weeks for you guys to make your teapots. Um, but it's a really big prize. You can win a, one of the cases. Grab that case over there in case anybody hasn't seen it yet. You can win a five-set uh, paper bead rollers plus the case. One of these beautiful cases right here. Um, by just making something with these little teapot findings and submitting your photo into the contest. So don't forget, um, and you don't have to use these findings if you don't have them on hand. You can actually just um, come up with a teapot design on your own if you really want to. Mm -hmm. But we'll have two more people will win findings in the replay plus the, um, the big prize. All right. Donna McCormick wants the large handle green. If you'll write that down for me. 
The teapot deadline is the end of the month, I believe. I need to go double check, but it's definitely not before the end of September. Um, so that gives you another seven days, I think. Actually, we could extend it, probably, since nobody's entered yet. Let me go. Yeah, and it went out a little bit later. Than it we did go out a little later than we intended because of me being not quite recovered. Let me go look. It'll just take me a second. I gotta move the laptop away. I'm pulling up the page. So if you go to, um, it should be paperbeadrollers.com slash teapot dash contest, it will get you to the page. And I'll repost this in, in paper bead rollers too so you guys can get there. But, um, <sighs> Oh, no. See, look, I did. I moved that to the deadline. The deadline yeah. is um, October 13th. So you actually have until October 13th to make your teapot and um, and submit it. Because this is a really good prize, you guys. I mean, this is this is huge. This is like, I don't know, 70 some dollars total or something like that. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So this is a really big prize. So teapot deadline is October 13th. Yes, you can order the teapot charms from me. Um, if you don't win them, we do have them in stock. They're only they're $1.99 mm -hmm. um, on the website. And shipping is like, I think it ends up being $3.50. Yeah. But you can buy as many findings as you want. If you're U.S., um, I do $3.50 shipping on like as many findings as you want. So you could add more stuff to it just to make it worthwhile, I guess. But um Yes, so the teapot charms. I'll post all that again in, paper, in the Paper Bead Fanatics group. If you're on this live and you are on, you're not in the Paper Bead Fanatics group on Facebook, go join. Just go to Facebook, search Paper Bead Fanatics, because we do a lot of really fun things in there. We do a lot of contests, we do giveaways, and everybody gets to show off the really cool things that they make. Mm -hmm. Seriously talented people in that group, you guys. Seriously talented. It's amazing. So um, what size bead works with the teapot charm? So you can actually do a few different sizes, but I think the one that I put in here was a round eight millimeter uh, round bead. But if you did a bead that was a little, you could do a bead that's larger if you make it more like a Euro bead, like where it's a little bit longer mm -hmm. um, or like a more of a saucery but rounded, you could do a larger bead than that too. Okay. Jerry win. Oh, Jerry, you won the teapots. Donna won the Donna won the the bead roller and Jerry won the teapots and Nan won the teapots. Yep. Okay. Cool. Let me make sure we got that right. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Well, I, that's really all we had planned. I mean, you know, it's fun hanging out with you guys, though, but we'll do another live. Like I said, as soon as the person who wins the big contest gets the um, package, we will do another live then, and maybe we'll hang out a little bit longer, too. All right. Did we go over the judging for the um, teapot? Oh, no. Thank you, Kate. This is, see, this is my Kate. Um, the, here's how the judging for the teapot contest is going to go, okay? And this is where it gets really fun, because I've never done this before. I'm not going to choose who wins the teapot contest. Kate's not going to choose who wins the teapot contest. You guys are going to choose who wins the teapot contest. So what will happen is you'll go to the form at um, paperbeadrollers.com slash teapot contest. Actually, let me put that in the chat right now. Well, this is the long version of the URL, but both work. Uh, you don't need to have a certain roller with the teapot findings. Any roller will work because it's not really about the roller size, it's really just about the diameter of the bead. And a, about an eight millimeter, probably a 10 millimeter might work. It depends on how you do your design. Mm -hmm. But around eight or 10 millimeter round, uh, a round bead. And like I said, if you make it a little bit um, oblong, it can be larger. Um, okay, so I just put in the link in the chat for the contest itself. And um, what will happen is you'll submit your photo and then I'll put your photo up on the website and people can vote on it. So whoever gets the most votes by the end of the contest um, will win. So you have to have your submission in by the 13th 
Um, and I think as soon as you, I think the way that I did the rules is that um, as soon as you send me the picture, I will have it up within 24 hours and people can start voting on it. So the earlier you get your teapot picture in, the more time you have to get votes on it. And mm -hmm. anybody can vote. They don't have to log in or anything like that. Um, your friends can vote, your family can vote, you can post it on Facebook and everybody you know can vote. So um, yeah, the earlier you get it in, the more votes you'll get and more likely you are to win. So I would love to have, I would love to have a bunch of you guys do this. You're so creative. Um, I cannot wait to see what kind of teapots you make. Are we keeping the deadline for the voting at the same date? Um, I'm going to relook at that just because I, with my surgery, I haven't been able to really promote the contest. And since nobody's entered yet, I feel like I could probably extend everything a little yeah. bit. So I'm going to relook at the rules and maybe extend by a couple of weeks just so, um, you know, just since I haven't really been able to get out yeah. there and push it very much. But, um, good. Thanks, Kate. See, this is why I have Kate around. <laughs> All right. Uh, Maureen asks, do you know when your round bead stencils will be available? So I haven't been able to work on those since the surgery. I was having a little bit of problem getting them to come out right. So I still have that on my list, but I don't know when they'll be ready. Um, cause they're, they're proving to, you know, round beads are so tricky. They're yeah. way trickier than any other kind of bead. But I will beat it. I will have a round bead stencil, I promise. Um, so I will let you know when that one's ready. All right. Well, I think that's probably it. I'm so excited to spend time with you guys. Congratulations to everybody who won. And if you didn't win, don't be disappointed because you still have that chance mm -hmm. to win the big prize and the teapots. Um, comment as many times as you want. You can spam the comments. I don't care. It helps me um, as a YouTuber when you make comments on videos and it helps you get more entries to win. So we're all good. All right. I'm really excited to see who wins it. I know. I'm excited, too. I'm excited to let somebody else help us reveal stuff. Yes. That's always fun. So, all right. And here's for anybody who just came on. Where is the package? Where to go? It's behind my laptop. What? Thank you, Kate. Um, this is it. This has all of the new Christmas findings in it. And this is the grand prize that you can win by commenting on this video once the video is over and the live has processed and you can then add comments. All right. All right, guys. Have fun, and we'll talk to you again soon. Love you all. Bye. Bye. <laughs>